dog every time. Uh, those odds mean nothing to me. You know, whoever's making those odds it's, it doesn't it doesn't affect me at all. Uh, I'm in the gym training all the time. I got some of the best coaches in the world, and uh, you know I'm pushing all the time. I'm getting better all the time. And UFC has brought out the best in me. Uh, my my loss to uh, Ellen Berger really woke me up and made me make a lot of changes. And uh, I think it's shown in my last three fights. Uh, since we didn't really get to talk to you after the last fight, I was wondering if I could get your thoughts on your performances. I mean, it seemed like one of the closer fights. A lot of people thought you won. A lot of people might have given it to uh, Ricardo. Uh, I, I, of course, you always want to get a finish. You know, you always, you always want to get a finish in, in front of the eyes of the UFC. Uh, you know, some, but competition is, is tough. You know, uh, I'll take a win if I can get it. But I always love a, a finish. Uh, I wanted to fight. Almeida wanted to wrestle. Uh, anytime we were, uh, you know. In any exchange, you know, he was around my waist trying to take me down, which I had to try to, you know, stuff that most of the fight. I hit him with some good shots. He was able to take it. Um, you know, it is what it is. I didn't get to finish. That I wanted to finish. Could I have done better? I feel I could have done better, and that's why I'm back in the gym, uh, working harder to make sure that I do uh, finish. You know, I've been asked that question a lot. Um, I guess uh, I'm a late bloomer. Uh, I'll take that, though. Um, I'm healthy. I'm, as, I'm healthier now than I, you know, I ever have been. I think I, uh, due to my fighting style, I don't, I don't really get into a lot of, uh, you know, uh, rock and sock and robot type fights, you know. So I don't have a lot of years, if you will, on me. But because of that reason, um, you know, I, I can't, can't give you a, an answer why, but uh, I can give you an answer that I am. I'm, I'm going to be in hell to deal with now at 35. And Rory said that he, you know, he doesn't really pay attention to the guys that he's fighting or look at tape of them, something of that nature. Um, is that a mistake in your opinion? Uh, it, it, what he thinks doesn't matter to me. Um, you know, when when we get in there and we start, you know, finding that rhythm of the fight, you know, he'll he'll find you won't be able to hang with my rhythm. So uh, that's it. Can you kind of give your impressions of his overall development as a fighter? He's obviously impressed a lot of people so far. He's definitely an impressive fighter, no doubt about that. Um, I'm, I'm in the UFC. We're both in UFC. We're fighting in the UFC Saturday night. Both of us are going to be tough, no doubt about it. There's no slackers in UFC. Um, you're always tested when you're fighting anyone in UFC, whether it's their first fight in UFC or if it's their tenth fight in UFC. You're always going to be tested, and I'm very, look, I, look, I look forward to this test. I, I'm, I'm really anxious about it. It's a great matchup. He's got skills. I got skills. Let's put it together, and let's make a show.